gym hasn't changed a huge amount. So we might see more of a stress of skill Ooh. in terms of guns and the players than otherwise. I like the one my band that we see. Was connecting hallway on the split. Red has become a firing line and the grenades are popping off too. There's three falling back into the favor, but Kachit is still going. Gets one more, two kills under their belt. Unfortunately, cannot find the third. Poseidon finds the end of the big cat. The big hammer of Khajiit was not enough to uh, to wreak the havoc that was necessary. Now the pressure's gonna come in. Just over a minute left and Cap oh, can. How, no? do How do you do that? that? You should not be allowed that kill. And yet here we are. Need a big waste coming through. And uh, Amar will be falling there as well. Sparko to go for a kill. X7 will be finding another one as well. C4 will be hitting its target and it's only up to death now. It's gonna have to try and uh, find five kills, but it's a flawless round for Union. Union starting off very well here. Something which we could maybe compare to how Mercenary started off the last map. We're worried about this one player fluke that it might come back to harm them. We'll be able to spot out the head finally getting that kill. That's how simple it can be. Not having to waste two of the grenades to actually get that one in. And that's up to Sparkle in that mirror window to just hold the line, beat to hold down onto this window that Death might be wanting to jump in from. They should have this in the back. Union should have this round. There's not enough time to actually go for it. C4 will be tossed through as soon as the plants will go down. There he comes. That's the kill. Onto the diffuser. Now we got sniped out. Beat able to pick up a kill onto Amar. It's Sparkle to go aggressive. We'll be able to stop the diffuser from happening. Beat goes aggressive right now, but he will be passing Khajiit somehow. The plants will be going down, but Union, no, will be cancelling that one off. Seven underneath. They may still have the C4 in pocket. They don't anymore because they used it to get a double. I think that's a very good return of investment right there, Fluke. Is Daft will be able to respond. Sparko will fall, but there's still two members left right here. And the likes of Kieran are up against the four of Union Gaming. The diffuser will be recovered, but Jittery is going to be able to pick up a kill, but instantly responded to by Avim. Which charge come through, barbed wire will be destroyed and he has to push through. Needs to get three kills to manage to pick up this round. And that will be the first, the mirror gets spotted out, won't be able to pick up that one. And as he swings into the mute, it's Beat that gets the kill. And it's Union to go up four to zero. What a fantastic play. Three of them on one tight angle. We've seen multiple of them suffer from the same angle before and here, well, they do it in the same way. Jittery from deep with a big guns control as you pointed out you X7. always get gunned down and you get gunned down again x7 with the rotation right through the middle of the remaining players and hey why not one more for the road five in a row Five in a row indeed, and I want to say Jittery got his life safe there. Practice and comes from history. Oh, beautiful shot there from Jittery. And in. Khajiit detected, but well, was anyway. As they try and fire through against the bodies that might be in, the frag grenade does unfortunately very little. The alibi has already been gunned in the head. Jittery, Sparkle and Poseidon have three different angles. But for the first time, so do the members of Kira, I say, as they double down on a single door. They're looking for an entrance. They don't really have much left to do. And Poseidon gets a very easy pickup. Now they know where both of them are. They've taken one. The second is in exactly the same angle. And with only a few seconds left, well, from now it's just an exit pad that doesn't even pad out. Union, a perfect hole go and lay down and there we go there they come they're coming up with two members right here but one is going to get picked up it's the second one as well no that's one is going in favor of you um, union gaming it means with 20 seconds left there's a lot of pressure coming down on kira avim finds one on the red stairs and sparko's looking for a quick entry doesn't see the man to his direct left and the shotgun pops up from the middle of the room but doesn't get there in time to save the life now it is just a two versus one beat all is left on the board the thermite is looking for one can't find either and Kira, for their first round, take their first point. Not the 7-0 coming in, and that is surely something Kira Coming close, they know where someone is. The smoke canister starts to hinder the dance around the armory site. The push comes in against the man inside Church 2. They know where he is at 20 seconds. Oh. The body is dropped and a C4-2. And Kira find their second. Rettler and B is getting the last trade in, and that means we're seeing Amar just seeing it all unfold in front of his face as the turn might hits the deck where jittery gets forced inside the smoke canisters takes him away from the door over peaks and over stretches and avim is able to make jittery's pretty exceptional round so far be over a big worried spray comes through but khajiit blows a man up and there's the rever reverse rotation and kira 
a third round in a row. Third round to come in in a row indeed. And I I, I like what uh, like Jittery tried to do there on the blue stairs here. Is Sparko able to find the kill onto a Vim? It's going to be Daft to go down as well. It's only up to Khajiit right now. And it's going to be Sparko to finish that one off. One kill at least comes in. Possibly yes indeed. It's beat to be dropped. But the diffuser is already near the side. Poseidon should be able to get that plan down. There's still one C4 left. It will be tossed up. But it's not going to be able to get the kill down onto Poseidon. And that means Khajiit now needs to rotate yeah, up. He needs to get four kills, but he will find none. He will be picked up. X7 will be getting his first kill of the half, mind you, because after the round swap, or the site swap rather, he wasn't able to find a single one yet, but he will be able to find the closing one though. And thus, Union, one map up, one map into the grand finals. 7-3, Union, and a perfect half to lead you into that. A very, very well played. Get reinforced and this the Mira is gone, which is understandable given Union's record of bringing Mira. Let me note all these down in my little book. Yeah, window maybe. No, instead he's gonna be just walking up the white stairs, able to pick up another kill. Act seven will be dropping. C4 kill will be getting yet another one as Amar picks up his triple. Anybody that might be playing towards this pillar side. Oh, there is. They're very close and they're actually gonna swing on you now. Shoots too high though. Misinterpreted where those bullets were coming from. Mistook it for a, a building sized bundle of chaos, much like Chowder. Namo right now is going to be rotating all the way up the white stair. He's going to be missing his first shots. Runs into someone who's droning. Jittery picked up there somehow, not aware. And right now it's going to be Sparko to try and run across. He's going to get picked up as well. It's a triple kill from Amar, but he will be running right into the gunfire. Off beat to that moment in time. That leaves us in a two on three situation as Poseidon also picks up into Gajit. Inside Clubhouse, but you've got to realize they did it with the knowledge and safety of six rounds behind their belt. Here, they're doing it with barely any of that. And Kira, well, they're seeming a little bit cooler under pressure as they take another couple of bodies inside Freezer and find their second round. Do it with a gun instead. Finally puts down Valkyrie and Poseidon finds Avim. And they're looking at trying to lock off their first round here on the top floor. They move into a slightly more aggressive position, but unfortunately, Union are there to meet them. Yeah, Randy. So you think you're going to follow up with that one? I thought I was so far. Unfortunately, it seems Union has woken up a little bit. Jittery gets one, but the response comes from a Vim. There is yet another, however, falling to X7. Wing the man. They know exactly where he's heading. They can wait and set up towards the top of the stairs. We hear an air jab, but it doesn't even matter because Union just shoot him instead. He doesn't spot out the actual uh, elbow of the sledge. He now drops through and comes in with the SMG-11. No, actually the L85. He gets the kill. The plans will go down oh, as Beat is inside. He's going to be getting that plan down. That means 45 seconds will be on the clock soon. It's going to be Avim to try and stop things from happening, but he will be taken down by X7. It's only up to Khajiit right now in a one on four situation, but it's very unlikely he'll win. And indeed, he does not. Union will be able to pick up round number five, and that means they take the lead yet again. And I believe Fluke, but I'm not. They still have the shield. Now they obviously don't because they're dead. And I'm just going to assume because that wasn't used, they were supposed to have a C4 and unfortunately didn't have it to hand. Two versus two, one comes back the other favor, but there is one more. A great swing from Avim is able to take care of Beat. And now it's all down to Poseidon. Doesn't quite know where the body is. That reveals them, but the shotgun that you know how to spell. And I don't care about spelling because all it does is things like that. The more you believe in it, the more it works. Avim coming in clutch right here. The connector from Piano and X7 himself, who oh just God. jumps out for two more kills. Why save the man who's down when I can just kill everybody that's a threat? Onto the red hatch, he doesn't see X coming up right here. We'll be able to pick up yet another kill. That's a quad kill. Backing out for him anymore. There comes a prone angle and Jittery is going to be able to pick that one up. I was afraid for a second he will be missing his shots and Khajiit might be able to respond, but he will be able to get that kill. And that means that Union Gaming will... Look before you leap, but it doesn't even matter for Jittery, who plays up, gets the pre-placed and is going to head off as somebody else decides to go up. And X7 decides to go off. The big cat Khajiit swipes back and takes oh. the big player out. But who cares when you can just charge up and Amar finds a double kill. The Claymore at the same time strikes and almost saves it. But Jittery looped. Jittery two and one more goes their oh. way. Rattler 
takes care of the man I was just talking about, blows up the Maestro on the backside, and this is a lot of pace that they want to bring to this kitchen. A single set for that Maestro can would have been enough to get the kill, and instead he's going to be able to pick up yet another one right now. He will be finished off, though, Beat, able to get that kill in. Turns it into a two and two as the plant goes down. One will be spotted, and that is going to be the kill. The Diffuser will be dropped. X7 able to get that one. It's all up to Khajiit right now, and it's one on two. He needs to find both Beat and X7. Starts it off with Beat, brings it to a one on one. 25 seconds left on the clock, but his head will be spotted out. Is X7 going to be able to get the kill? Not yet. And on the second try, he will. It's X7 to get a Union game into grab the six yet. But that in no way means he's safe from the guns that have already that taken right. two of his teammates. The diffuser goes down alongside Habana, who's now bleeding out and taken beyond. As Beat gets one, and now it is only one. Avim is off the board too. Yet again, all down to Kajis. Everything to do, and in a fashion that they have defined, Union Gaming. Flawless, their final round for us. Haven't lost a single defensive round. And I said before, X7 is a, well, a very deciding factor in this. But I think that we can also give a lot of credit to Jittery. Jittery, he was able to step up on the attack when X7 couldn't. And also in this last round, picking up those two entry kills onto the likes of Kira. And you said it before, Kira should be the team that could upset Union Gaming. But Union was...